Hello, my name is IvexSHDV, Kumi Fraser, and welcome back to Minecraft Story Mode. We are still on episode one, but we wow. left off here where they had all nether. just entered yeah, the nether. Yeah, that is a lot of lava, and fire, and other things that could burn you to death. Pretty much everything in the nether can burn you oh, to no! death. Oh, that's and crap. That is yeah. very, very much a trap. Maybe it was like... New guy. What oh, yeah, hold on oh, tight. Maybe crap. it was a you trick or Everybody hold something on. to kill them, after all. Maybe he pranked him. Pranked by Jake Paul. <laughs> that was a screenshot moment there. Oh no! Oh, down, 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 down. You don't want to get your head hit by that. And down again. I feel like you need to stay alert for this, just in case. Okay, so I'm not the only one seeing that we're running out of track. There's a lever right, right there. No? Good. Right for the lever. Jesse. That switch! Now, do it! Oh, what happens if we don't get- Oh gosh. Now. What happens if we didn't get to? <laughs> wow! I thought something bad was gonna happen there, but <laughs> I guess everything's gonna be... Whoa! That was a strange... No. Whoa. Wait! Oh, man. They're all being split up! Uh, Axel, this reminds me of, um... Shadow of Israfel. <laughs> Shadow of Israfel has happened as well, before Night Peculiar died. Spoilers, of course. Hang on, Ruben! Alright, let's fight out zombie. Not zombie, skeleton. That's it, there Ruben. we go. Okay, Ruben, remember how I said everything was gonna be just fine before? I know I was wrong then, but I have a very good feeling about Uh-oh! Whoa. Spoke too soon. Duck. Oh, crap. That usually kills him. This game is unrealistic. Ow! There we go. Now it's realistic. They die first hit usually, but that first time, they didn't die at all. Well, gas are officially crossed off my to see list. Done with the gas. Never need to see them. Oh, there's another one. Oh, crap. Oh, I'm one last fireball. Oh, no! Well, that was bad, lucky. Bad, this is bad. Oh snap! Oh, Ruben, hold on! Oh, oh and they're all conveniently there as well. Oh, nice of you to join us. Is, uh, is everyone okay? <laughs> they all seem so dead. angry. I guess that's pretty good. Ditto, ditto. But they're not dead. I just can't believe that Petra comes down here all the time. This place is awful. It's true. <laughs> Your throat's gonna be sore later, Axel. Why? I'm just saying. Wasn't that you doing all that screaming before? Sounded like you were really <laughs> shredding your larynx. Oh, yeah. I heard that, too. Really high-pitched, kind of like a squeaky pistol. We were just lucky to make it out alive. That's more than most people can say. Their bones are probably still sizzling away in that lava down there. Wow. Morbid. That is quite morbid. Sorry. Sometimes I wonder whether it's best to just say nothing in this game. I click these buttons, you don't really know what's going to be said after it, but some of the things said after is just so dark. Can you throw up like you regret saying it inside your body? Uh huh. I know because I just did about five times. <laughs> wow. Look at this place. All these tracks converge at this point. You could probably get anywhere in the world from here. This is actually the hub to a Minecraft server. The portal. <laughs> this is what Gabriel was talking about. That's our way out. It must lead back to the surface. The surface is also where that creature is. I think that stopped He's Axel right. in his tracks. We have no idea what we're walking into. It could be dangerous. It's a quite well constructed portal though. No one ever constructs something that awesome in the nether. <laughs> Thanks the for first being I've so seen. brave, Axel. All right, I'm gonna go. I'm going. I'm going right now. Go on then, Axel. He doesn't want to do it. Like right, right now. I just need to make sure I have everything I'll need. Yeah, he he really doesn't want to do it. I think I put the uh thing. Screw it. Right, let's just do it ourselves. I'll go first. That's not what I was saying. Well, you clearly I'm don't want to go up. You clearly do not well, want to go up. Absolutely up. insist. Yeah, you, you're happy about that. Well, see you guys on the other side, I guess. Be careful. Thanks, Jesse. Yeah. 
Should be thankful. He's just saved your life, potentially. In you go. Wait, why can't I go in? Do I need any of these things on the side, or...? Oh, I need to walk. I forgot. I thought I had to, like, click. Alright, here we go. We're walking in. And in we go. I may have just killed off Jesse. Oh, we're in a pile of water. Okay, not what I was expecting. Something tells me that's been recently created. Alright, get your sword out. That's it, good boy. And there we go. There we go. He's gone. Oh, man. That was close. There's only one zombie. There was a zombie. Oh. Is it dead? I mean, yeah, he's know, dead, dead, dead. He's dead, gone. Dead. Yeah. Oh, I get it, because of course zombies are dead Where anyway. Are we? I didn't even think about in that the first. Dark in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Maybe we should bed down for the night. It's dangerous to be out when it's just dark. When's Ruben's no, black eye gonna be healed we're up? We're looking for a giant building. It should be pretty obvious. I've already said. No, I've already said. Well, then maybe this is the temp. I'm being sarcastic. Axel, come on. The order wouldn't build all that yeah. track for nothing. It's gotta be here somewhere. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. Uh, I was agreeing with you, so... I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> the yeah, unnecessary arguments going on here. Uh, this is like an average uh, friendship group. You're supposed to be shelter, heroes. Shelter. I was going to say shelter. I say we build a tree it's mimicking house. him. That'll take forever, and we'll be exposed while we do it. We just need a quick and dirty hut. Look, whatever it is, we gotta do it fast. I agree. See, he's got his head screwed on. Just what? do it! Just In build a, a hut. hut. We won't know what's coming until it's knocking on our door. Let's build a hut. It won't take as long. It's not. That's it, Olivia. Jesse made the call. We yeah. should get started. I'm the ringleader here. I made the call. Therefore, we have to do it. That's all we need. Just punch the dirt and bang it down. Just like that. I mean, when I said dirt hut, I wasn't expecting that, to be completely oh, that honest. Works. That looks quite good. And we're still eye level with monsters that are trying to kill us. Oh, dig a it's hole! It's done. It's over. We aren't talking about it anymore. We could have maybe done, like, a multi-level thing, but that's too late now. I mean, it's... it's cool. It is pretty cool. Let's I mean, together, you don't guys. ever see dirt huts that look as cool as that. I just expect, like, a 3x3 three three thing with only, like, one space to stand. And they got a fire inside. You can't have that in a standard tree house. Oh, man. What? I'm going to tell you something. You have to promise not to freak out. What is it? I have cookies. Oh. One for me. One for Olivia. One for Jesse. Thanks, Axel. What about... Don't leave the other guy out. And one for Reuben. Oh. Sorry, Lucas. I only have four. Oh, no. It's it's all right. I'm not that hungry anyway. Nah. Just Be nice to him. He's done you favors with slime balls. Something. Give him the cookie. Yeah, he's already get, he's done, he's done a massive favor for us. Take it, Lucas. By giving us a slime ball, so we're giving <laughs> no, the cookie. No, no. I, I I can't do that. I insist. Thank you, Jesse. It's only fair. That was for you, Jesse, not him. Why is he angry about it? The other guy's a good guy. Everyone seems a little bit glum. If you had to, which would you rather fight? A hundred chicken-sized <laughs> zombies? Or ten zombie-sized chickens. Come on. Choose wisely. <laughs> uh, that's a good one. Let me think. How can you guys joke at a time like this? You gotta Petra lift the mood. Still out there. You gotta it's lift your spirits yourself. somehow. There's nothing funny about. Gotta that. stay positive. Exactly. Can't just mope. We've gotta keep our spirits high. No, we should be moping. That's exactly what we should be doing. Well, you go Excellent. mope in the corner then. I'm right, right. Maybe, no. but she's going to be fine. What makes you think that? She has to be. Yeah, Petra's gonna be fine. Fine. Then, uh, we should get some rest. 
We gotta start looking for this temple as early as we can. Now, my guess is if we start at the portal and kind of split Whoa, up... Oh, what are you doing? Did I do something to you? I'd really like to know. Because you keep getting yeah, on my yeah. case for what seems like no reason. He's just trying to help. See? I'm sorry, Jesse. I'm not gonna sit here and listen to this guy telling us what's what. I'm just trying to get ready for tomorrow. He's good to have a plan. You're a the only plan. one wearing that stupid jacket. Don't tell us what to do. This is getting unnecessary with the arguments. Back. Back. Can't. Wouldn't. Oh. You know what? I get to wear this jacket because I know how to build. But that doesn't mean I don't know how to break things. Your threats don't scare me now that we know how you really are. What yes, is up, Traveler of Nation? I wasn't going to bring it up. But I I'm your host, so much. Jesse Gamestar. That's all come down. Just drop it. Don't be like that, Jesse. Just drop it. Haven't you done enough damage for one come day? Come on! Petra might be dead because of you. Shut You're up! You're taking this too far. Yeah! So I don't have to take this. Listen, why don't I just leave? and let you guys hash this out. You can't leave. It's dangerous out there. I can take care of myself. Stay with us. It's what Axel wants, right? Let him leave if he wants to leave. Yeah. Axel's You're being a dick. You're not going anywhere. But Jesse, that's enough. We're all Yeah, I stopped the Lucas from leaving. Yeah. Zombie size ah. chickens. That's what I would fight. Why is that? Because I'm starving. That's fair enough. Thanks for keeping me around, Jesse. Yeah. It's a good thing he stayed. I was he'd be soaking out there. Safety first. All right now, if I'm right, this is the final chapter of episode one of Minecraft Story Mode. We just finished chapter five, though. And I think we're going on to chapter 6. So we'll complete Minecraft Story Mode in this episode. Well, episode 1 of Minecraft Story Mode, anyway. It's quite a nice day. It is quite a nice day, although tensions are still quite high. Everything you okay? okay? It was a rough night. It happens. We were all tired, and I'm just glad you're okay. Thanks for being so cool about it. Cool beans. <laughs> yes, he is a good guy after hey, all. There's something over that way. How do you what get up there so fast? Oh. Some kind of building, I think. Let's get a closer look. <laughs> they were right next door to shelter all along. They could have stayed there for the night. Ah, well, up we climb. What is it? It looks like the convention center, but destroyed? Maybe? Yeah, this has to be this it. This has to be the place. I'm not too sure what it is. Oh man. What is this? I would've broken my legs if I jumped from That's that That's what we're light. trying to figure out. It's the Temple of the Order of the Stone. Oh. Lucas, are you sure? He's right, look. So this is where he uses Oh, ah. do you think they're in there? Let's go in and find out. Man, Let's that thing got destroyed. Okay. If you spot anything, call it out. We don't have a lot of time. Isn't it weird how dispensers are carved to look like? Can that saving cloud go? There we go. What do you dispense, little guy? I get the feeling that we don't really want to find out. Get behind me. All right. Look, I can see some pressure plates down there. We're gonna get ambushed. There's traps and everything. We're gonna need to like walk around it. Yeah, okay. Man, that saving cloud is enough. Oh no. That's probably not a good thing. No. Definitely oh, come not. On, dispenser faces. I thought we were friends. Run! Let's hope it's just Oh. Ow! Down. So I've been hit once by arrows. I'm hoping that doesn't affect me later on. Oh, there's loads. We're trapped! We activated the dispensers with that pressure plate. If we can figure out a way to trigger it again, I bet that'll shut them off. Go there's get to the end then. Table. Maybe we can make something useful. 
Out of what? We don't have anything. He's got the string. All of our tools and materials are back home. Make a bow, grab some of the oh, arrows that are flying. Let's see what we've got to work with. That's it, make a bow, and then they'll fire an arrow at the pressure plate. Yes, that's it. Night. And I've he's got, got string. And a piece of string. All I have make some arrows, chicken feathers. Chicken feathers. There we go, it's a bow. Machines. It's a bow and arrow. Well, let's see, I've got... Flint and steel, sword and some string. Yeah. Sword. Oh, and some string from a spider that I fought. String, Perfect. sticks, flint, and feathers. Bow. Alright, let's do it. I know exactly what we're crafting here. All right, so sticks. We want there, there, and there, and then we want to grab this string. There we go. Now we've got a bow. Perfect. And now we want to get a stick. We want a feather. Oh, I don't know which way this goes. I think that's an arrow. Yep. Yeah, there we go. Bow and arrow. Let's do this. This is exactly what we want. Pressure plate right there. You got these. Perfect. All right. The order. It's just convenient how we have changing. the exact amount of items that we need. All right, I'm gonna see if I can disable that cloud saving. This is so annoying. Uh, settings. Alright, one of my mentor puffer for. Can't disable it. Off, there we go. Alright, there we go. I finally turned off cloud saving. So we won't have any of the annoying this cloud appearing. Must be there every single time. Room. Doesn't this look like Ivor's creepy basement? It does a bit. That's a good point. Maybe he used to be one of them. Should be kind of creepy if that was the case. See what Lucas has found. Find anything useful? Not sure about useful, but definitely interesting. There is a lot of history in this room. I guess if we had a lot more time, we'd be able to find out a lot more about the Order of the Stone and all of them. The battle was fierce. But the Order of the Stone emerged triumphant, saving the land and ensuring that peace and prosperity would reign forever. Well, I thought you couldn't exactly read the text forever. on the enchantment table. It's like random glyphs. These five, five members, five friends. Oh, hold on. Together would give so much to gain their rightful place as five. He was part! They would author their own He was enemy. part of the Order of the Stone! They would slay a dragon. Ivor was a member of the Order of the Stone? I got it right! The stories never mentioned him. This is so crazy. This might explain why Ivor had such a grudge against Gabriel. They lied to us. They lied to the whole world. Why would they do this? Man, I can't believe you punched Sometimes a member things of the Order off of not the said. Stone. This is so crazy. The Order might not be what we thought they were, but Petra is still out there. That monster is still out there. Yeah. Jesse's right. 
We need to focus on what we came here to do. Where do these stairs go? There was only one way to find out. Hey, there we go! One way to find out. <laughs> oh. Now this is cool. Wow. This is kind of cool. What happened to the walls? More like what happened to this whole place. This must have you been might have where they met. Up. So where are they then? Gabriel said that once we find the temple, the amulet would lead us to the Order of the Stone. Well, what are you waiting for? Pull it out then. Let's find out. Amulet, show us what you can do. Is something supposed to happen? Well, that was a letdown. Just a bit. There's got to be something we're missing. Look around and see if you can find anything. Maybe there's like a little totem that he's placed on. I think that's going to be the case. He's reading. Axel's obsessed with the map. Pedestal. This has got to be it. Yeah, it's, it's got the, the icon. There's the amulet. That's got to be it. You got to place it in there, maybe. Use amulet on. Yeah, there we go. Nothing really. All right, what have you got to say, Olivia? We're in the temple of the Order of the Stone. The Order's actual. Oh, she's just fangirling about it all. <laughs> Who'd have thought it, huh? A bunch of small towners like us wrapped up in an adventure like this. Yeah, it's pretty insane. I just hope we all come out the other side in one piece. So this hasn't, actually, this hasn't done anything, really. Ruben's just gonna oink. Or will he lead us somewhere, maybe? Hey, Ruben, find any clues? <laughs> no. Wonder when his black eye's gonna heal up. He's had such a rough journey so far. Find anything interesting in that book? The only thing I found so far is that the amulet was used to track the positions of the members of the order. And so maybe it's does on the it map. Mention how? It's less technical and well, more historical. So now we've put the amulet there. Maybe it will display on the map. It's a map of the entire world. This is way nicer than the one at Endercon. <laughs> Alright, what about Axel? What's he found? Nothing. Whatever. Axel. He's, ho he's holding the grudge. I was just trying to figure out where Petra might be. I mean, I know she's gonna be fine, but I was just curious. We're gonna find her. There's a lever. There's a lever. Maybe we need to pull that lever. Alright. That's gotta be it. So we're gonna walk around here. Yes! Look at them. Alright. Let's use these switches then. Okay. Each switch does a thing. Oh, this is going to be so annoying. Uh, middle switch, maybe? Boom! Wow. That's it. It's That's absolutely it. absolutely incredible. How did they build this? That's actually... Imagine that okay. in Minecraft. Now I'm impressed. What do you think the colors mean? The different colors represent the different members. Ah. It's the order. It's showing where they are right now. Look, we don't know enough about There's how only this two thing of them. works. Maybe the amulet only tracks them when they're on the surface. Or maybe it doesn't work when they're in the nether. We have to go off what we do know. Uh, so, oh, maybe we... Should we find the people that we do know about? He's trying to there tell us something. There are two lights on that map. If there are only two heroes left, then we know what we need to do. We need to go find relying them. on us. That wither storm is still out there. We know that Gabriel was trying to tell us something. So Gabriel's blue. We've got to find the Order of the Stone. But there are only two lights. There are only two members of the Order left? He said Soren was missing. That leaves Magnus. Or Eligard. Let's head out. I'm not going with you guys. I have to stay here. What? Why? If I know Petra, she's probably doing everything she can to find this place. She's still out there. She has to be. But what if she didn't make it? I'm gonna have to make a decision where we should go. Axel, Jesse's right. Petra might be... 
go on. Oh, it's automated decision where you have to go or not. there's a small chance she's alive, I have to stay. Go. Get help. I'm going to focus on making this place safe before nightfall. This temple is pretty big, though. If we're going to have a chance at fortifying it, I'm going to need some help. If, uh, maybe one of you guys can help. Oh, my God. Sounds like Olivia will have you totally covered while me and Jesse are out finding Magnus. Finding Magnus? You really think that's how it's going to go? We need Eligard. She's the world's greatest engineer. She'll figure out a way to stop that thing. We're trying to destroy it. And when it comes to destruction, Magnus is the master. You're a smart person, Jesse. And obviously, the smart thing to do is to go get Magnus. I... <laughs> I think Axel meant Eligard there, Oh, Jesse. I don't know. Uh, no. I don't think I did. Pretty sure Axel meant Magnus. Jesse, the point is, you should be going to Eligard's. It's the choice to me. You've got to come with me. You're my best friend, Jesse. It's you and me. Like always. Think about it, Jesse. Oh, this is more of a gut all right, call. All right. We need to make sure we get this Either way. Either way here, I'm going to shot. let someone down. Whatever decision you Axel's make, Axel's had I'll a hard cool time. Really? As long as it's me. Come on, Jesse. This is All an right. easy call. Do you know what? I am so sorry, Axel. Olivia, you and I are going to Eligard's. Awesome. Axel, you stay here with Lucas and get the place ready for when Petra shows up. What? With that guy? I'm right here. Come on, Axel. For Petra's sake. Fine. I'm really I'll hoping they'll get along. For Petra. I'll take it. I'm really hoping they'll get along. Uh, guys? Oh my god. Please hurry. Oh my god, that thing is huge. And that's episode one. Jesse and Olivia return to the nether. Intent on finding Eligard, the Redstone Engineer. And find themselves in a place of mechanical marvels, Redstone rarities. Amazing Red machines, can really help, yeah. limited only by the imagination of their brilliant creator. Maybe the combination the of explosives and Redstone consuming will destroy it. In its wake, time is running out for our intrepid heroes. <laughs> it's very dramatic. Oh. You I mean 63% of players sought out Gabriel's help, okay. You and 52% of players helped Gabriel when he was escaping the Wiverstorm. You and 74% convinced Lucas to stay in the shelter. Okay, so we did the majority. We followed the majority of people there, which is quite interesting. It's quite interesting. I wonder how the story would play out if we didn't do any of that. Maybe it'd be completely different. Maybe we'd be in a completely different place right now. I don't know. But those are interesting stats. Anyway, episode one is over and done with. Next video, we'll be continuing with Minecraft Story Mode on episode two. Where we continue the adventure and find Eligard. But for now, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please be sure to smash that like button. Leave a comment down below what you think is going to happen in episode two. How is the story going to play out? Do you think Axel is going to get along with... Thingamabob, names suddenly escape my head for some reason. I don't know, we'll find out. Anyway, thank you so much for watching once again, and I will see you all on my next video. Goodbye.